Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel, Shawzy Wowzy. I appreciate you for tuning in. I'm here to show you the training needed in order to test visitors for COVID-19 before they can be allowed to visit their relative. How to process COVID-19 testing using a lateral flow device process reporting result. Check it out, guys. After doing this testing, when a visitor actually comes, they have to wait for about 30 minutes for the results before they can visit. And they can only visit if they are negative. These are the things you need to do before the visitor actually come to visit. So you have to do some testing and I'm just doing the training online. This is the training. You just need to read this, go step by step. So now I'm just going to click on this. It says transcript. Okay. And after that, I can close it and then scroll down again. And it brings me here. This is where the testing is negative, positive, involved, and invalid, rather. Invalid and then frequently asked questions. Okay, then I click on the home page here and it brings me here. So I've gone through the processing, then I go to the test. So, go. question number one Which of these following should you avoid doing while processing the test? So all the options are correct. Question number two, why is it important to record the time of the drops? The answer is A, it takes 20 to 30 minutes for the results to be shown on the testing device, the LFD. Okay, so I'm doing, I've just um, clicked my answer for two, which is correct. So now my answer here is... What does the line on the testing device mean? Invalid. What does the line on the test and device mean? The answer is positive. For the fifth question, which is the last one, what does the line on the test and device mean? Negative. So now I am going to go to um, view download, okay? So now it's going to view download. And then let's see, I don't know what that is. So it's saying, um download certificate so yes okay so this is my certificate which means i have been able to achieve 100 percent so now i'm gonna go and print my certificate okay this is the process of the second one so and then so this one needs to click the strip so that you can read the information there After reading, close. Oh. This is scan, log, and clean. That's the process. Mm -hmm. And then you go to home page, and it's saying hundred percent. Then you go to the assessment. So in the assessment, this is the assessment. Should the manual enter? Which of these following must happen immediately if the barcode scan fails? The answer is you should manually enter the barcode number in the app. The second question says, when should your work area and equipment be cleaned using antivirus wipes? Answer, after recording each result. Third question says, how would the result be communicated to the subject? And the answer says the text and trace system will link to the result to the correct record and will communicate the result. And then, so now it's taking me to the certificate. So I'm going to download the certificates here. 
So that is the second result, which... Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed the process of the COVID-19 testing using the lateral flow devices of processing and reporting results. Thank you. Right,